even in our hearts, we were crying and it was a very, very hard accident. Yeah. And you couldn't even imagine it. But what you, you cannot even imagine too, that how God deals with that. Hmm. He was he was not like a commander who is giving us an order from the skies and, and that's it. Hmm. No, no, no. He cried for his friend, yeah. Lazarus. And he was actually beside us in that moment. And he was like, he was crying for us and crying for our pain. Wow. And, and crying for all these beloveds and all the people that we lost and we are loving them and we are still loving them. Yeah. And this is how God, because God is love, mm. like it's written in the Bible. Yeah. Yeah. Amazing. I know, well, I don't know, but for me, if I experienced something terrifying that like that, it would be very difficult for me, I think, to love those people who hurt my family and my community. There is a story I, I'm always telling. Like, if I'm standing in front of a big hole and someone pulled me in that hole, I will get hurt and I will get injured and I will be very mad. Yeah. And what is the first thing I will need to do it after I get out from the hole? To help that man or kill him or whatever. Yeah. But what if I got out of the hole and saw that man is a blind man? Mm. What should I do? I think I will take his hand and cross him that hole. Yeah. And actually these terrorists are blind. Mm. They didn't see the light of Jesus before. Mm. They didn't see how good is he. Yeah. They didn't experience it, how love and what is love because God is love and they didn't experience it, God at all. Yeah. And they didn't experience it, how, what is love and they didn't love the humans they, they see. Yeah. How can they see, love the God that they didn't see? Yeah. That's wow. it.